Okay. So, let's chat. Life update. I know the last time I talked to you guys, I was like, I'm big and I'm ready to start giving y'all some content. I really do miss you guys. I have missed you guys. Um, I've been through a lot lately, if I'm be honest. And it really hasn't all been easy to digest, to grow through. The past couple of weeks specifically, I have not felt like myself. I have honestly just been dealing with things as they come as best as I can. I just had to get real with myself and realize that we can't control the things that are happening to us. What we can definitely control is how we react to what's happening around us, no matter what it is, no matter what form of adversity we're going through. For me, that's something that I have to work on within myself like every single day intentionally and if I don't then I do find myself getting a little lost I find myself slipping into like depression anxiety and just like really not being present because I'm such a control freak I won't even say I'm a control freak no. what am I talking about no I release being a control freak I release perfectionism for me that's just what I deal with if I'm not totally in control of what I want for me for my family and I spiral like I get in my head and it's just it's crazy it, it just is and that's just really what the past couple of months have been for me it's been a lot going on a lot has been changing a lot has changed it's been quite an adjustment to say the least So the past couple weeks, I've really just felt myself slipping away more. I haven't really been taking intentional time to partake in my spiritual practices. I've had to put up quite a few boundaries. I've had to cancel a lot of things out of my life. I've had to do some tremendous healing recently. It shit gets heavy. It gets so heavy. Really, all in all, I got clear on myself that it's just time to bring myself back. But I'm fine tuning a couple of my routines, my spiritual practice for sure. I have decided to bring you guys along the journey. So, I have decided to do a 60 day challenge for myself and I welcome you to do it as well if this is calling at you, pulling or tugging at your heart. For 60 days starting today, I will be doing specific things consistently, intentionally and really just reinventing myself. You know, like reinventing who I am as a person wholly from inside out. Um, I'll definitely insert the things that I am going to be making law for the next 60 days. So the goal is really for the next 60 days to just be as intentional with my practices as possible. One thing I want to be more intentional about is my journaling process, um, how I reflect on my feelings, how I release the things that aren't serving me and my purpose. I want to make sure that I am moving my body like three to five times a week, actually strength training, um, getting in some cardio because that's something that I shy away from, and then stretching intentionally. Um, I love being super flexible, and in order to do that, you know what I'm saying, you got to actually stretch. So being intentional about that. And then um, meditation daily, like that's something that I really got to get back into the process of. I used to can meditate for like an hour plus, and now it's like 15 minutes, and girl, I be like, okay, what are we doing? <laughs> So that's something else that I definitely want to implement these next 60 days. Drinking plenty of water. My water intake has not been the best and I want it to get better. So you have to actually do it in order for it to get better. And one of the last two things is no alcohol. No alcohol. And eating healthier. 
and just feeling great. So yeah. You feel like you need to be reinvented if you feel like you want to elevate your life in the next 60 days definitely hop into this 60 day challenge with me drop a comment below let me know that you're tapping in i might create a little group for us so we could all connect yeah that'd be dope that'd be dope so if you want to do that drop a comment below i will create a group for us we can all sit in there together and we can chit chat and we can share our journey and our experiences and things like that i would love that if you would like that too let me know thanks so much for tapping into this video if you made it this far and i'm so grateful for you i'm so grateful for just being able to have a space to just be me so thank you for accepting me for who i am love y'all and remember to love yourself wholeheartedly, radiate with positivity, and vibrate at your highest frequency. Until next time, peace.